Welcome back. Our guest this afternoon is Rod Chappell. He's of the uh, Jefferson City branch of the NAACP, and there's a big annual event coming up this, the, again very soon. There is. There is. We're having our annual Freedom Fund Dinner. Mm -hmm. It's the 50th Freedom Fund Dinner for the Jefferson City unit of the NAACP. Exactly 50? Exactly 50. Okay. So is this a special, a special dinner then because of that? Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, we're doing a... I'd li like to tell you we're doing things bigger and better. Mm -hmm. So hopefully we'll have more people there this year to celebrate not only the achievements of the NAACP over the 50 years that we've been having the dinner, but literally over the life of the organization, which is well over 100 years now. So you have quite a history there. Absolutely, absolutely. And we've talked about this before. The there's still a need for, for your organization. There really is. There really is. Mm -hmm. You know, what started out back in, uh, I guess it was 1909, as an organization primarily aimed to keep African Americans from getting lynched, mm -hmm. has really expanded its focus to encompass all uh, the civil rights that we as Americans appreciate. So whether it's the ability to work, to vote, to live where you want to live, to go to school and get an education, we're talking about those fundamental American values. And that's just a constant battle, obviously. It really is. It oh, really is. Okay. We're really fortunate this year, though. Our Freedom Fund Dinner, our keynote speaker, is going to be Claire McCaskill, it's a the big senator. Name. Yeah, I tell you. And it's I not an election year. <laughs> no, not at all. <laughs> not at all. You know, we're really fortunate to have her. Uh, with the work that she's done in terms of protecting uh, Missourians and consumers' rights, mm -hmm. uh, protecting people and their fundamental human rights from being abused, uh, it's really an honor for, her to, for us to have her there. Sounds like a nice night. And you have a silent auction that's part of it? Two with the dinner? We do, we do. Uh, items are still coming in and we're still accepting donations. So, okay. uh, but, but every year we have some very nice, very nice pieces. Okay, and this, uh, you want, of course, you're selling tickets now for this event. And who, who, who wants to, who can come? Absolutely. Anybody, everybody is welcome to come. Uh, the tickets this year, is it okay to say that? Sure. Uh, are $50. Mm -hmm. uh, they're a little higher than normal, but with the idea that we're going to use the extra money to set up a scholarship fund. Every year we give two scholarships at the dinner and that provides a means of, uh, uh, for to allow people to go to college here locally uh, as well as the ability to uh, have enough funds for the unit to organize and operate as it should. Okay, and we, we should warn you, you can buy those tickets and you can still have some time, so that's good too. Absolutely. Okay, well, we appreciate you being here today. Hey, thank you All very right. much. Good luck.